Today I'm sharing a coach handbag unboxing and my first impressions. Hi and welcome, and welcome back to Chris's Dilista, where we find joy in the happy medium between minimalism and maximalism. I talk about personal style, shopping, thrifting, handbags, and a little bit of travel. We're enjoying life right now, present day, without any lifestyle changes. We're not waiting to be thinner, to get a better paying job, or to be coupled or uncoupled, to live personally fulfilling lives. So I received a store credit for a bag that I recently returned. I'm really horrible at using credits and gift cards before the expiration date, so I thought it would be best to go ahead and buy a handbag before I lost the money entirely. The first bag that came to my mind was the Coach Willow Tote. I have it in black, but it came out with nickel hardware this season. And I thought about it, but I ultimately decided to pass because the original one that I have with gold hardware it is so warped because of my laptop that when it's empty, it will fall over. If I don't reshape it, it will tip. So I decided, you know, why repeat? Why get the exact same bag? I opted to get the Willow shoulder bag. I believe it's called the Amazon green color block. The name of the bag initially threw me off because I thought it would be multicolored on the outside, but actually the color block portion is on the inside only. So yeah, I appreciate that because um, I wanted to have a nice solid color bag. So the interior and the exterior colors really do complement one another. I've also been really surprised at the versatility of this bag. I've been able to wear it with multiple outfits, including today's outfit, which I wore morning for a target run in 54 degree weather, light rain. I had a universal thread jacket on. I always want to say universal design, which is a different thing altogether. I'm wearing a Nili Lotan for target shirt. Old Navy cami, Zella leggings, Aquatalia boots. The color is called Brass Amazon Green Multi. It's polished pebble leather. There's an inside snap pocket uh, on this side. And of course it has the C turn lock closure and it has a shoulder strap and a crossbody strap. It retails for $350, but is on sale right now for 25% off. If you're considering getting a coach bag, I strongly advise against using any third party payment processors on the coach.com or coachoutlet.com websites like PayPal or Klarna because you cannot take the bag in store for a refund. You may be able to get a store credit, but you won't be able to refund in store. You would have to return it. And just to be mindful, particularly at coach outlet stores, when they ship their bags, they don't ship them with return labels that are prepaid. So if you decide that you don't like a bag, you bought it using PayPal or Klarna, when you return it, you gotta pay for shipping back. So you won't get your full refund. And it's just a clunky, muddy process. So if you're going to shop coach.com or coachoutlet.com, pay them directly if you can using PayPal, or Klarna is a hassle 
And that is why I have this today. I had a store credit for a bag that I purchased and I was unable to get my money back. But I'll show you on the website in the return policy about this. So I will highlight that for you. So you will make better purchasing decisions going forward should you decide to purchase from Coach. Even though I like this bag, it honestly put me off Coach a little bit, but it's not their fault, it was mine. So just be mindful of that. Now, I wanted to share what fits in this bag and what I have in it. This morning I actually did carry it, so I have my Target receipt. I have my, you know, useless purchase, but I love it so much. My LV sunglass case. I have some tissue. Keys and measuring tape for some reason. Okay. A silver pouch and it has a charging cube, Apple charging cube and some old earbuds in there. The wired earbuds. And that's all for the turn lock pocket. On the other side, I have my aligners in their case. I have a LV pochette. I have my uh, glasses, my reading, well not reading glasses, my prescription glasses, but Tom Ford, thick as all get out, guys, so just can't see. Let's see. And in the middle secure pocket, I have inhaler, clay, my little pouch with, what's in this bag? More earbuds. Why do I have so many earbuds? I don't know. Okay, girl. Medicines. Hair tech. Verona lactone, which I take daily for my skin. Hair, skin, and nail vitamins. Okay, more earbuds. Wireless, okay. More medicine. And that's it. I think this is a great bag for everyday carry. The size really works for me. Um, now that I've finished a, a major writing project, I no longer have to bring my laptop to work every day. And so now that I don't have to carry my laptop to work, a bag of this size is, is perfect for me. It easily fits my essentials and I don't feel like the bag is overcrowded. Putting everything that I need to be secured in the middle pocket works fine and it zips closed easily. I actually like it a little bit better than the Willow Tote. The Willow Tote, sometimes I'll put my essentials in it and it buckles, but I don't have that problem with this bag. And I'm wondering, is that because I'm putting less in it? I, I don't know. It seems to carry about the same with the exception of the laptop, of course. But yeah, so let's let's go over the interior one more time. So it has the C turn lock in the front. It has a snap closure in the back. It has a zip secure pocket in the middle. And there's another pocket for essentials there as well. And, and that's it. So all in all, a good little bag. So my only issue is that when I carry this Cross by you that sometimes the shoulder strap will disconnect. And I don't know where that, why that is. I haven't been able to work that out yet, but as soon as I know, you'll know. I've been really surprised with the versatility of the bag. I've carried it to work multiple times. I've actually posted a picture wearing it at work on Instagram. And my Instagram handle is the same as my YouTube channel name, Krista Stylista. Check me out. And that's it. Enjoying the bag, happy I got it. Positive review. Please let me know if you'd like me to do a video specifically dedicated to my coach collection. Happy to do it per your request. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.